My name is Christian. I have been studying the culture and people of Liberia. Liberia is located in West Africa and is bordering the North Atlantic Ocean. Liberia was founded in 1822 for the resettlement of freed American slaves. Because of this, you can hear American English spoken on the streets. Rice is a favorite food in Liberia and is eaten at least twice a day, every meal if possible. Even though rice is an inexpensive food, many children in Liberia are too poor to even eat it three meals a day. Many people in Liberia grow their own rice, sugarcane, or cassava, a starch fruit. Even though they grow their own rice, they prefer it from other places because it doesn't have small rocks in it. Today I'll be cooking one of the popular dishes named jollof rice. It is made with bits of meat, rice, spices, and sometimes vegetables too, whatever's available. Many West African countries claim to have originated this dish, but it is traceable to the Jolof tribe in the Senegambia region of West Africa. In every country, it tastes a little different, but it's based on the ingredients. Let's begin. To make Jolof rice, you will need one pound boneless chicken, half pound beef cubes, and half a pound of bacon. And the next, we have half a cup of oil, two onions sliced, one pepper sliced, three ounces of tomato paste, one and a half pounds of cabbage, one and a half cups of rice, and six cups of water. At the same time, I've already cut up the meats, sprinkled with salt and pepper, and coated with flour. So now we're gonna add the oil, and add the meat in small batches, I'll be back when the meat is brown. The meat is now done. Now I'm going to saute the onions and peppers for about five minutes. See you in a few. Now I'm going to return the meat to the pot. Add the tomato paste. Add the water. on top of the pot. Lower the heat and let it simmer for 10 minutes. Next, we're going to add the rice. Finally, we're going to add the cabbage. We're going to let it simmer for 20 minutes and stir often. Our jollof rice is done. In traditional custom, the table is set with the dishes turned over. So when the guests come, they can turn them over for clean dishes. Before they eat, they greet each other with a handshake. The other person pulls their middle finger and snaps. But due to the outbreak of Ebola, they now touch elbows and are more cautious. Time to eat. In Liberia, they eat with their hands. It's good.
thank you for watching my video. I hope you learned a little about Liberia and its culture. Here's the recipe for jollof rice if you want to make it yourself. And you can take a screenshot of any of this if you can't read it.